the parents. Both parents are looking so beautiful. Do you agree? Amazing. You are looking beautiful. You are shining. You are glowing. And thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This is so beautiful. You know, um, for this part of the marriage, you know, I am... Um, I need to introduce myself. My name is Idahosa Osakai Iyawe. I am from uh, Uzebu Quarters of Edo State. Uh -huh. And uh, you can see the. I'm represent, I, I wish I can say I'm representing the Oba of Benin. But please, that's where my Benin ends. So please don't expect me to speak Benin. Uh -huh. I can now small Benin for people. Yeah, that's where it ends. But please, you have to go to Ekenwa Road to hold my parents responsible for not uh, allowing me to speak the language. But we are very excited about what God is doing today. In this ceremony, what would happen here is the Okaike, the oldest male in both families, uh, will be doing a negotiation. But today, I'm the Okaike of the groom and the bride. Put your hands together for me. It's not an easy responsibility. Well, we are doing it. Okay, so at this point, at this point of the ceremony, um, Kaibe has come and is speaking for them, and he's going to ask and let the the, the 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 bride's family know that they were walking past their compound and they saw a lovely flower, and they would like to have their permission to pluck that flower. All right. And um, you know uh, the the the, uh, the bride's Okaibe also, who is the eldest male, is also saying, "See, there are many flowers. I'm sure you can look. Do you see many flowers here? Do you see many flowers here? There are many flowers in the garden, and um, we need to know which one exactly you want to pluck. And also, the groom's." Parents, I'm going to give him the microphone. He's going to state their intention for coming, and he will let us know why they took all that stress and journey to be here. All right, sir. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. You're going to let us know um, um, why you came. Usually at this point you are going to actually not just come, you are just going to also come with some gift to just water the ground. Is that correct? Uh, to say we have come or... And you say why you also came. Over to you. I am here to witness the marriage of my son <laughs> to a wonderful lady. I can also see that uh, I can also see that you um, you came with some, some some gifts behind. I see some you came bearing good gifts, gold, frankincense, and myrrh. <laughs> All right, uh, I'm going to just hand over to the. I don't I don't know what they want to say about this. Uh, they're going to say yes. I'm going to let your presence before we see the group. Yes, I wish to welcome them, and uh, I am very confident that what brought them, if they can satisfy some conditions, they will have the flower. On behalf of my family, we are waiting to hear from them. Thank you so much. All right, you can see that it's a very serious. Uh, it's a very serious matter. There are some conditions to be met. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you know, before we begin to proceed, we want to see, uh, because we know that the groom's, the groom's uh, family did not come on their own. They came with a special, special song, a special one who is going to dance in now, who has come, because this flower is not just the family that is plucking it, you are plucking it on behalf of the son. You know, in Africa, we like family so much. And that is why you can see we are engaging everybody. Everybody is wearing clothes. Everybody is. In fact, I'm just, I'm, the, I'm just, my heart is with you. <laughs> you know, and I know that. Don't worry, this, the day will soon be over. <laughs> All right, so we're going to welcome 
the fresh groom, dashing dapper groom. Ladies and gentlemen, he's coming with his friends. Where's your friends? Where are your friends? Let them be your, let them be your fronts. Let them be your front. Give it up for the dashing groom who has come all the way to look for a beautiful bride. Matt, I hope that wasn't too much pressure. No, no, no. In fact, he was singing the song. This guy is ready. See, now God win because this one I cannot do it by myself. All right. So, ladies and gentlemen, you know the, uh, the 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 groom's family have said that they have come to pluck a flower. They have come to look for this African Benin flower, precious flower. But we want to be sure that he knows what he is talking about. Do you agree? Yes. We want to be sure he knows because, I mean, you can come and you are not sure of the person. So we are going to, um, we are going to call the bride and um, she's going to dance in and she will dance into the front and let's, we are going to have Matt be sure that he is, that she is the one that he has chosen. He's the one, he's the reason why he took this journey to be here. So DJ, give us some good music. Let's welcome our bride for today. beautiful very fair I'm going to ask you a question or no na now or no na now am I getting it right or no na noa or no na noa or no na noa is means is this is it this one is it this one and you will say oh that's if she's not the one but if you want to say a, eh, so it's up to you. <laughs> don't blame, don't blame the 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 adult teacher. <laughs> it's up to you. So I'm going to ask you, or not, or no, and if she's the one, you say a. Eh. If she's not the one, you say L. Eh, oh. Are you okay with the lecture? 
And I'm telling you what. <laughs> you, you understand? Yeah, because I don't want you living here with more than one wife. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to ask you now. Oh, no, no, no. Hello. Put your hands together for him. He says, this is not the one. This is not the one. Okay, next time, he said, you have to take the view to be sure, so that your wife will come and you will miss her. Uh -huh. Please, oh, I was not there. All right, so let's have the bride. Now, this should be the bride. So, DJ, let's go, let's go. <laughs> if this is your bride. So please go ahead. I know that you are good with cyber security, so you make sure it's... <laughs> is this Onona Noa? He has said El. All right, please put your hands together for him. Don't worry, don't worry. Good job, good job. Good job. That's why we are, we, are, we, are, we are giving you many to practice before the real one comes. <laughs> all right, all right. Thank you, thank you, thank you. One more, one more, one more. All right, we're going to welcome the bride. The bride, the precious bride, the one that is hiding behind the scenes. Ladies and gentlemen, DJ. <laughs> Focus on, on, on the person you want to marry. <laughs> All right, I'm going to welcome you again to unveil this beautiful African lady to find out if she's the one. So you can please stand up, unveil, and I'm going to ask you again. All right. <laughs> All right. Onona Noah. Hello. I want her friends and, uh, to join her as she dances in and I believe that this time we'll, Matt is not going to unveil and say L.O. again, right? Or L.O. <laughs> this time it will be what? That's the one he knows very well. All these other things is not part of it. It's not part of it. He likes the one that is for his wife. So ladies and gentlemen, DJ, let's welcome 
the bride. I want her to be at the back. Let's have her at the back. Presented 
this um, gifts and the dowry, and then we're going to present the bride uh, to the groom's father. I, I, I don't know, Daddy, if you can give me someone that will do that. All right. So, so you, you can, can bring for what you do some music. We we'll take it to the parents of the bride. Yes. We have uh, our list is there are many things, but one thing that is very important. One thing that's important. One thing that's important with the gifts is 24 naira. That's the symbolic bride price for the billion bride. But I like the fact that we change to 24 dollars without uh, without considering exchange rates. Come on, let's put our hands together for ourselves. I like that. One dollar is equal to one naira. All right, so. Mass will bow and just exactly. Alright. Alright, you can just drop the you can drop the gifts. this occasion when my daughter Abiyahua is to be given out in marriage so that she can go and start her own life as a family. I want to thank each and every one of you for being here and as part of the celebration we will continue with all the steps that are necessary so that we finalize everything that we have come here to do. Thank you so much. All right, let's, let's put our hands together for the bride. She's going to come to meet her parents. At uh, this uh, point in time, I would like to ask my daughter, where and who is the man you want to get married to? Would you like to present him to me? She has looked around the compound and she has found the person, the man of her dreams. So she's going to take a look at him. It is a pleasure that I have been shown a man who my daughter wants to get married to. We follow this one usually. With the spiritual aspect, I pray for them. And I will do so shortly. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Our 
Father and our God, eternal rock of ages, the unchangeable changer, the Lord of armies, the ancient of days. Thank you for giving us the opportunity to be alive, to see our children get married or marriage too. We are here, Lord, to celebrate this wedding and to believe and pray that it shall be well with them in the name of Jesus. Amen. You will guide them as they go and as they come out in the name of Jesus. Amen. Whatever they put their hands to do, whatever they put their minds to do, whatever plans they, they put on the table, Father, be part of it and make them succeed in the name of Jesus. Amen. We pray that you give them good health. Yes. You give them love. Yes. You give them lovely children. Amen. Obedient and good children. Amen. We pray, Lord, that laughter will continuously be in the household in the name of Jesus. Amen. We, their families, both on the broom side and on the right broom side, Father heaven, bless each and every one of us in the name of Jesus. Amen. Even the friends and the well wishers that have come here today for one and life, Father bless them in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father, for hearing us. Thank you for doing what you have asked you to do for us. For in Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. In the mighty name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Most merciful, most benevolent Father, we give you all the honor, glory, and adoration for a beautiful day like this. We thank you because you are awesome. You make everything beautiful in your own time. We are grateful. Lord, we thank you for bringing Matt into Abiwa's life. Lord, as we join them together today, we pray that your presence will continue to be with them. You will go with them in this journey. Yes. You will never be alone. Whenever they call upon you, you will answer. Amen. Father, you will make them fruitful on every side. Amen. You will bless them with good health, with love, with children, God-fearing, lovely children. They will be friends. This union will continue to be friends. Like I said, whenever they ask you for anything, Father, Always be there to grant it to them. They will, never, they will never lack anything good. Father, we thank you for their lives. We thank you for the lives of both families. We thank you for all our friends. Now, when we hear from them, it will always be good news. When they hear from us too, it will be good news. We always have cause to glorify your name. Father, please, you know all our heart desires, even before we ask. You know our desires for this couple. We pray, Lord, that you do for them more than what you are asking. All the good things that will make life and marry sweet, you will give to them, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for hearing our prayers. In Jesus' name we are free. All right, ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for them. The father of the bride, begin to hand that over to the father of the groom. As it is in our place, families get married to families. The decisions are done between the heads of the various families. I represent my family and Mark represents his family. So I'm going to hand it over my daughter to him and believing that he she will be part an integral part of the family. So we do that now because it's part of our of our culture. Uh, is uh, sir our traditional way is for you to accept whatever thereafter you pray for them. So, as I hand over my daughter to you, we will, at least they will get a chair for ma. I will hand over Abiyawa to you. So, you, she will be an integral part of your family. 
But the husband had also entrusted her to him so that she can take care of her. I will do that shortly. I will, um, from one to seven, I will make sure I make up here to sit on your laps seven times. And thereafter, you are pronounced husband and wife. Your daddy will pray for the two of you. Your mommy will also pray for the two of you. So I do that. Yes. So, okay, well, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. To have to hold. This is the literal meaning. <laughs> Alright, the parents of the groom are going to pray for the couple now. May the Lord bless you and keep you. Amen. And keep his face shine upon you. Amen. And be gracious unto you Amen. for all eternity. Heavenly Father, thank you for bringing Abby into our family. I pray that you bless their marriage, be part of their marriage. Uh, Lord, you know our hearts. So thankful that Abby is part of our family now. And, um, so I wish all the things for my parents have prayed for them also on them, children every blessing in life. And we just thank you for your life for all of us and your, your sacrificial death so we can all be together in eternity. And we just thank you and um, bless Abby and Matt. Amen. Come on, put your hands together for them. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming here. Now, this family is going to give an advice to the new couple. Your job and responsibility is to take care of your wife, treat her right, no violence. But as a man, there has to be one captain in a ship, not two. And uh, we know how the reward works. Sometimes you have to defer to your wife. But decisions are better made when both sides make it. And uh, you are now a full-fledged member of our family. And she is no longer a full-fledged member of our family. She belongs to this family. She can't come back crying home. <laughs> if she has a place in the father's house, it's going to be rented out. <laughs> so, my daughter, this is your family. The most important thing you do is you, just as you honor your father and your mother, this is your new father and your mother. And these are your new brothers and sisters. This is your family now. We are just an associate family. So, Matters are better solved when it's solved between you two without bringing in a third party. But when it comes to that, go to your father-in-law first. If you're not very comfortable, most women are more comfortable going to another woman. You have a mother here, you can always go to, to have issues resolved. And uh, we will continue to bless you both with our prayers. Just the advice from this family. Now, this is your You can always come visit us, but you can't stay anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Earlier on, in continuation of what my brother just said, 
the DJ did make reference to the symbolism of the presence that you brought and the symbolism of the bride price in our culture. Um, he made an assumption. He had done a very good job. Um, but he made an assumption and he didn't elaborate on the symbolism of this for the benefit of those who are not of that culture. The symbolism of the presence and the bride price is to let the bride know that this family, these gifts are accepted wholeheartedly. We don't eat and vomit. That's the symbolism. I mean, we are not asking you to bring gifts to us. So we ask for gifts from the groom's side to symbolize to the bride. We are going to accept this presence. We are not going to return them. We are going to drink those drinks and we are not going to vomit them. The only condition on which this marriage can be separated is if we return. There's an occasion where this presence will be returned back to your parents. That's the symbolism of this. We are never going to return them. And if you are going to separate, you have to constitute another gathering like this at which this presence will be returned. Thank you. We reject that in Jesus. Amen. All right. You can see that our marriages are very serious. Oh my goodness. A lot of education today. If you had second thoughts, you will, you will counsel those second thoughts. Come on, let's put our hands together for the beautiful family. Thank you, thank you. I have no doubt you think our marriage was made in Africa. <laughs> we cherish our bride, we cherish our family. So we're going to play good music for the couple to dance, for us to celebrate. I'm telling you that this occasion you saw today is actually a summarized version. When I got married, you know what I saw. I bought things for the girl's mother, for her father, for her brothers, for her sisters, and they were all symbolic. <laughs> Think about it. <laughs> My price um, for Matt to just present this Bible to his wife, also symbolizing that this marriage is not just husband and wife, but there is God in the marriage. We know that marriage is a representation of Christ and his church, and he binds and keeps this marriage. So you're going to uh, present this Bible to her and declare that your marriage is you know, ordained by God and is kept by God. Our marriage is ordained by God and kept by God.
end of the night At the bathroom, flash up I want to flex my love I want to press And I want to carry my love To a place she loves I'm a mama, mama, mama. I want to press And I want to carry my love To a place she loves The latest couple in time Mr. Like poison, I take my chance with you. If I did. 